Hi everyone. Yes, back in the shed. This is my first shed video since getting back from sabbatical. So uh, yeah, back to work, back to the shed. Been back for nearly three weeks now and it's great to be back at the point, back home again and uh, yeah, getting back into it all. So we had our AGM last night, our annual general meeting. Thank you so much for everyone who came and it was a Thanksgiving, an evening of Thanksgiving for an amazing year that we've had, the last 12 months, a year of generosity, I called it. We have given so much away financially to our mission partners and to other appeals, to those in need. Thank you for your part in that. But we've also given people away. Uh, it's been, uh, yeah, it's just been encouraging to see how God's using. We've given the people, the team we sent to St Edwards with Jules Middleton, what a difference they're making as that church is really flourishing and growing now, which is wonderful. We've sent people off to St Andrews to be a blessing there in Burgess Hill. We've sent, we've sent the Shoreys off to Horsham uh, to be a blessing there and start a new work there, which is exciting. And we've sent Mark and Sarah Steele off, uh, of course, and their family to Holy Trinity in Hurstbeer Point. And it's great to see what God's doing there. And, of course, John and Janine Norday. We sent them all the way to Birkenhead. Uh, but our vision is to be a transforming presence throughout Mid-Sussex. And that's what we're celebrating, the way God's using us to make a difference, to bring his kingdom right throughout Mid-Sussex. It was also great to hear from Liz and Dean about the work that's going on in local schools. They, they talked about at least 12 different local schools that they're both going into regularly. Amazing to see the difference they're making. So that's our vision, to be a transforming presence throughout Mid-Sussex, going out there. And, and it's happening in so many different ways. So thank you for your part that you're playing in that. Thank you for your generosity over this last year. And a special thank you to Sarah Emmanuel, who's been our safeguarding officer for 18 years. We said thank you to her last night as she's stepping down. Uh, what a blessing Sarah's been. You've been great, Sarah. We so appreciate all you've brought to the role. And also thank you that you're gonna help our new safeguarding officer, soon to be announced, uh, to step into the role. Uh, so yeah, that's been wonderful. All the reports will be up on the website next week. So you can read them if you want more detail, the financial report as well, of course, giving all the details of our accounts for the last year. And finally, don't forget to get those bids in. Uh, it's the youth fundraiser a week on Saturday. Come on, let's get behind our young people. They're raising money for their big mission trip this summer to Hereford. It's going to be brilliant. Uh, you don't have to buy something. You can just donate some money for the trip. That would be wonderful to support them. But uh, I hope you've had the email all the wonderful things that people are donating. Let's get some bids going. Okay, God bless you. See you Sunday.